Okay, guys, we are back. Part four of the Wasteland 3 playthrough. And um, we're halfway through Garden of the Gods. We're about to take on what I can see is the first kind of uh, boss battle. We'll see if we can manage to set this one off um, on our terms. Still getting the hang of uh, how much you can sneak before setting off con uh, combat. So we'll see. Oh, who's this? A little fox. We don't have anyone. We've got the full squad, everyone's f pretty much fully fit. Lancelot, Tyrion, Doc Nails, Ice, Marshall Quan, and we've got Lucia Wesson with us as well. Um, I don't have anyone with Animal Whisper, but I know that you can disband. We, so we've just got Major Tom with us, who we got by giving the cigarettes. Um, but I know that you can disband animals and then check what sort of buffs um, another one would give you. I think you can only have one animal per squad. My uncle tells me you're a Dunno. man of questionable morals, Mr. Kwan. Well, that's why I'm on the payroll. Somebody's got to get their hands dirty. So good folk like you can keep your hearts clean. That's not how Colorado Springs right, works. see what these things. I don't think we can't disarm that one yet. So we need huh. to I'm sure you know be careful. That. At least we've spotted it though. Let's see if we can sneak past it. Booze box. Okay, pick up a bit of wine. Tastes as good as it smells. Man, the negatives for drinking alcohol seems crazy. Drink to gain plus 25 melee damage for 36 turns, but suffered minus two action points. Like, no, thank you. But we'll take it because we can sell it. Right, okay, who we got? We've got a hunter, we've got an ambusher, and a hunter, and then we've got this guy, the Beastmaster. So. 42. Do we wait until he comes up this way and start combat with him and try to take him out nice and quick? It's an option. Spread people out a little bit. Lucia. Go there, get yourself in some cover. Ice. You go there, dock nails. You go there. Ice. Oh, give me a bit. Okay. Ah, oh, I couldn't. Why couldn't I? Out of range. Hmm. Mustn't have had a clear shot. What we'll do is... I think that's the play I'm going for, though. Put Marshall Quan down here to cover this side. Tyrion. Go with Quan. Ice. Um, ice doesn't have any action point. Is that right? Yeah, let's do it. Combat started. Okay, so if he hits with this, we could rocket him. 95% chance it hit. I don't know whether it's worth a waste on the rocket. I'm, I think they're going to be quite rare, aren't they? Lance, you can't hit him, but you could push up and then get a shot on him. What we'll do with Doc, try hitting with the. It's only a 60. Let's do it. Nice. Nice, Doc. And then Lance can't hit him. We can move him up into cover. See what these guys can do first, who they can take out. Okay. 
I'm guessing that Blood Beast is going to have pretty good range. See, I can move up, finish him off. Nice. Kind of hoping that the blood beasts might not be under their control now. He like he might be the one controlling them, but never mind. She can go to defend. Lance, you push up. Blood beasts are gonna rush, aren't they? The hunter's gonna stay in cover. Hunter, he's gonna rush the ambusher. I think what I'll do is Marshal Quan. You move up full cover. And yeah, take a hit. Nice hit. Not enough action points to do anything else. Oh, he's got a precision strike as well, buddy. So that's all good. That's all good. And then what I think we'll do. Oh, okay. The pump shotgun doesn't have a doesn't have a corner fire, okay. Alright, that's annoying because he's only on one, he's on two health. Annoying. Get her in cover. Yeah, so the blood beasts have rushed, we knew that. the precision shot just yet. I could take two shots of this. Nice. Nice hit. Out of range. Just out of range. Okay, I'll tell you what we'll do. Is we'll prepare with her and we'll carry over two action points. Fourteen to twenty. Man, these are pretty tanky. We might need missed thirty four, might need to use the precision. And hope we just to get extra damage. Nice. Probably could have just done that first. I'm going to defend with him just because he's bleeding. Dark Nails. Everyone's going to be out of range, aren't they, for you? He's pretty useless at the minute, Doc, to be honest with you. 
what I'm gonna do is he's got all right armor. I'm gonna push him up there even, even though he could come flanked. I'll go to a defense so he could at least take a shot next turn. See if we can take the killer out. One shot. Headshot. Nice. Tyrion. Tyrion doesn't gain any hit percentage for moving there. <laughs> so, go for hit. Oh. oh, he's got his pistol out, that's why. Doofus. Oh my god, what a mongo. He's firing with my pistol. Okay, what's his health? He's bleeding. Four turns left. He doesn't have enough action points to heal. He'll just defend. 17 and 17, Jesus. Early or we'll just set up an ambush dock. Nice, nice ice. Oh, no, no, no. I thought his dead body was a tree stump. No, she missed. Seventy-five. Uh, tell you what, I'm gonna move him there. Could get easily flanked, but we have got an ambush set up with Doc. Wow, I want Tyrion. Tyrion needs to heal. How long has he got left on his bleeding? Crap, 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 crap. Ah, uh, where's my medkits? For medical attention. What the hell? Bleeding. Does the injury kit not cure that? Why is he still bleeding? Med kit. Used to a saw. I used an injury kit, didn't I? Used to remove any injuries on target. Unsuccess removes injury. Oh, I don't understand then. I thought that that would remove my bleeding injury. Hmm. Okay, right. Pretty successful battle, though. What? What's in that pit? Pick up our loot. Wolf skull ornament. Vehicle upgrade, cool. 
vehicle part unlocked. You've unlocked the vehicle upgrade. Return, return to Ranger HQ to install it onto the Cordia. Sweet. Scrap armor. Scout pants, okay. Toxic spines. Some ice. Okay. Fang and junk money. Oh, couldn't air. Okay, we need. Requires two sniper rifles, so Ice can have that when she levels up. Ooh, what are these? Savage legs. Requires five strength, but gives you five armor. What's this? Tactical armor helmet. Ooh, that's, the, that's our first helmet. Who should we give it to? I don't want to give it to the companions because I don't know how long they're going to stay with us and whether they take the gear. Let's give it to Tyrion. Even though we can't see it. This is so small. scent of charred meat and burnt hair wafts from the pit, smoking bodies contorted by agony or post-mortem muscle contraction lie curled atop one another. It is impossible to identify the corpses, but they appear to be both adults and children. Lucia stares at the bodies, her knuckles are white on the grips of her gun, and her breath comes in little gasps. Hmm... Let's leave her alone. <gasps> With an explosive gasp, she releases her breath and squares her shoulders. I don't know if they're here or not. I can't... Come on. Let's find the monsters who did this. Was that not them? I thought we just, I thought we just killed them. Examine the bodies more closely. Near the edge of a pit, a child-sized corpse appears to be clutching something as if they were protecting it or hiding it. Take the bundle from the child's that, arms. That was one of the Skylar girls, I think. Seems like we ought to leave her alone. Feels an awful lot like grave robbing. You see her turns away, looking like she's going to be sick. Just, just looking around, seeing who's watching. Take the bundle. We got a burned book. You pull up. Bundle from the child's child embrace and take what's wrapped inside. Step away from the pit. Good. Oh, I love me and Molly. Equip that right now. I'm not carrying anything. Nice. Quan, do you want to take the molly? But don't steal it, dude. Where are the mollies kept? Go up here. Oh, what was that noise? Oh shit. There's ice. I'm gonna set some 
ambushes up, I think. Ambush. Dock. Move there. Ambush. Tivian, my old tanky buddy. Go there. Ambush. These animals are gonna bush us, aren't they? So. I noticed there, Major Tom didn't do anything in that last battle, did he? Who's this? Ice. Oh, Ice can't do anything. Okay. Shit, just the alpha left. Whoa, what was that? Good on you, Major Tom. What's this? What have they done to us? You're overwhelmed with fear. Well, luckily, we're not going to need too many action points, I don't think. So we're just going to... I blast this thing. No, what? Not enough action points? What do you mean, not enough action points? Oh my god, because we're minus two action points. Yeah, she can get some shots off. She should be able to finish this. Oh, she missed! God damn you! Good hit. Lance, can you... Nice. Purified tar. Waste wolf pelt. Cool. Oh, we didn't look at this thing, did we? Watch this. Hmm. The interface of the photon amplification lens looks simple. Most routines are automated, but there are some controls you can adjust. Oh, sh oh, I didn't even see what I clicked on there. Photon collection is at its lowest setting, currently reading 1.0 on the screen. An animated flower smiles as it basks in the light of sun rays. Increase the photon collection to its highest level. Activate. Oh, so that's another. Th that's an option you could took, isn't it? I didn't think you could go through there. We could have come through here, fought the wolves, gone up there, and then set them on fire. God damn it! Oh well, never mind. We know for next time. I hope you ain't watching these videos to learn things. Who are these guys? Yeah, these look like friendlies. Isaac Reed, the clothes on this young man are him. Impeccably tailored, the height of local fashion. He hurls his hands up and launches into what is obviously a prepared speech. I'm Isaac Reed. On behalf of all of us here, I want to offer our unconditional surrender. 
as proof of our goodwill, I want to tell you that the culprits got into town with help from Farron Brago's organization, and... and... And? Isaac, how could you? How could you throw in with these people? How could you let them take my family? Where are my parents and my little brother? They're... they're in the grave you passed on the way here. They didn't suffer, Lucia, I promise. Baby, look, I didn't mean it to go this way. I tried to stop them, I, I really did. I begged. Stop talking right now. Ooh. Wait a minute, you kids were helping the Dorseys? Just tell us how those people wound up dead. Piece of shit. You helped kill Lucia's family. And you want our forgiveness? Wait a minute, you kids were helping we the Dorseys? We thought we were in the right. The Dorseys promised that we could take down the Patriarch. They didn't say anything about murdering hostages. What about all the other people they killed? Or was that part okay with you, Isaac? Just tell us how those people wound up dead. It was Melius Dorsey. He went looking for your family, Lucia. Your family especially. That's why I got you out of your house before the raid. I didn't want anything to happen to you. You didn't want anything to happen to me? So you let savages abduct and murder my family. You knew what they meant to me. You knew what their loss would do to me. But you're still alive, Lucia. Don't you see? You're still alive, and that's what matters most to me. What a piece of shit this guy is. Were the Dorsey's acting alone? Did they have support from anyone else? Why did you do it? Yeah, I want to know Farron who they had Brigo's support from. Gang helped them get into town. I don't know how or why. And I overheard Neelius say something about Liberty Buchanan, the Patriarch's daughter. I think... I think she's going to attack Colorado Springs. It sounded like she's gathering an army out in the plains. Something way worse than the Dorseys. Okay. Why did you do it, Isaac? Why betray your community? We've been under the Patriarch's boot for 50 years. We say that the hundred families are in charge, but it's really just his family. Just him. I know you must think I'm a fuzzy-headed idealist, but this society's sick. It needs to change. He escaped. He took some vehicles and headed west into the mountains. I don't think he was planning to come back. I have heard enough. If your betrayal of my family was not sufficient, your treachery here most certainly is. In the name of the Patriarch, I sentence you. Her voice shakes, but her hand does not. You didn't even see her draw her gun. Please, Lucia. I did this for you. All I ever meant was to help build a better world for you. For all of us. I can't tell you how much I regret. Please don't kill me. Please. Kill that motherfucker. Go for it, kid. He's garbage. Please, Lucia. I love you. Bah! And then her hand does shake violently. She pulls the trigger anyway. The bullet strikes him in his gut. He topples, blood spilling from his lips. A slowly spreading pool of gore surrounding him. He turns his head up to Lucia. Agony in his gaze. It's going to take him a long time to die. Finish the job, kid. You wanted to take his life? Take it. Kill Isaac for her. Let him bleed to death. He doesn't deserve any better. Yeah, we're gonna let him bleed to death. It's like those poor old suckers had to burn to death. He can't summon words around his pain. He reaches out, trying to touch Lucia's leg. She steps hurriedly away, leaving him mewling in the snow. Oh god. It hurts so bad. Psychos! You killed Isaac! You kill us all! What the fuck? 
Oh shit. Tom, yeah, boy. Mm, okay then. Let's take these suckers out. I think those guys can do the most damage. Kind of feels a bit bad, to be honest. What else we've got here? 53, 53, 49. Let's see ya. Major Tom! We shot Major Tom, man! <laughs> What's this? Leader multi kill. The leader took on multiple enemies in single type boosting pipe morale. Cool. That felt a bit bad, to be honest. <laughs> I don't think those guys realize what they're getting into. This is Ranger HQ. We're getting reports of shooting in your last known location at Garden of the Gods. What's your status? Over. Um. Everybody's dead. <laughs> we killed every last Dossie rat, and a hundred family kids were helping them. Oh. Do we have a chance to cover it up here? Hmm. I think Lucia's gonna be like. We'll drop the ball anyway. She'll just be like, they were helping them. We killed every last Dorsey rat. We'll just put, we took care of the Dorseys. There's no survivors. Kick ass, November 1. Glad to hear justice has been done. Well. Over and out. I mean, it doesn't feel great, to be honest. Did just kill a bunch of kids, but hey ho, I mean, what are you gonna do? <laughs> These things happen on the big jobs. And look at all this shit we got. Ooh -wee. Love me some loot. Oh, nice. Scope. New assault rifle. Lance plates, armor modding, and some junk. Cool. The camp is a few days old. Look like the Dorsey's got it here before their attack on the city. I mean, I'm feeling bad about it. They were helping them, weren't they? Suture kit. No, 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 that's how you remove bleeding. Not an injury kit. Okay. Good to know. Good to know, buddy. Where does this go? You want to go travel to downtown Colorado Springs? Yes? You let me shoot him! Never shot anybody before today, and now I've gone and shot my boyfriend. I mean, what? My ex boyfriend. Don't play boss. Ex in more ways than one, I suppose. Oh, God. What the fuck? You were like, what? We didn't let you shoot him. You wanted to shoot him. I killed him. 
I really killed him. I can't believe he's dead. I can't. Oh, fuck. This is going to go bad for us. Don't blame yourself. We were the ones who told you to shoot him. Oh, no. Fuck that. Fuck that, man. You got justice for your family. Isn't that what you I, wanted? I... I did, but... Was this it? Was Isaac who I should have shot? I... I need to find the people who steered Isaac wrong. The people who were really responsible. Neelius, Dorsey, and Liberty Buchanan. Will you help me find them? You can count on my guns every step of the way. Well, yeah, as long as you stop blaming us. Jesus. Yes, we'll help you. In return, you follow orders like a ranger. Of course. Good. You've got yourselves a bargain, rangers. Yeehaw. We should go after Nelius Dorsey first. Isaac said he headed west into the mountains. No doubt he plans to hole up at one of the old resorts from before the bombs fell. I don't think we're ready to face him yet, though. Nelius will be dug in, I expect, and he'll have all his best people with him. He only left behind the expendables in the garden. I thought she said she was going to follow orders, not give them. Yeah. For now, we should head back to the sheriff. She's still giving out orders, Marshal. What you think about that, huh? What you think about that? How's the family? Shut your hole. Oh. I knew you slept with my wife. <laughs> hey, 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 slow hey. down. I didn't, I swear. I have got bedroom issues. Blackpool don't stand. Oh, fuck it out. You know? I... Uh, really? Sorry, man. Then who the hell was that in my house? <laughs> fuck it out. Crazy motherfuckers. All I did was ask a few questions. Oh, let's see if we can sell some booze to this guy because I've not got. Welcome to I don't plan on drinking any of it. Morning after Mart. If you did some things last night that you wish you hadn't, I got you covered. I can clean you up, sober you up, cure your ills, and get you ready to face the new day. Wait a sec. Aren't you the ones who kicked those Dorsey thugs out of the garden? The Rangers, right? Must be something I can get for you. Yep, there it is. That's us. Let's trade. Here you go, children. Salvation is at hand. Oh, okay, what we got? What, what booze have we got? Um, uh... Two dollars. Look, it costs twenty-one dollars to buy, and we can sell it for two dollars. Jesus freaking Christ! Because our bar skill is quite low, isn't it? <laughs> and it, antidote. Well, I've got some of that. I was going to say I'm probably handy to carry one of them. Ah, uh, we'll just keep our stuff for now then. Who's this guy? Bookseller. I don't need no books. Stupid. Let's see if this shopkeeper still sat about. Has he opened his shop yet? Can we go have a look. Ixnay, see how he's doing. They've been real assholes. I mean, they threw my brother up against the wall just for spitting on the ground. Shut up. Look, Martha, it's our friends who helped us save the shop. What can I do for you? We've got some discounts with your name on them. Sorry. Um. Yes, I would mind a discount. Yeah. You and your wife get along well? I don't give a shit. Uh, can you tell me about your shop? Show me what you have to sell. The old man smiles happily, showing you his wares. So have we actually got a discount? Or is this just like a storyline thing? Scrap her outfit. Just outfits. Work her outfit. Maybe you need them for... 
something later on maybe uh, impact form Christ that's all you got let's sell them all junk yes that's cool guns do we need all these handguns gonna keep stuff like that until we've got a bit higher barter and get a better price for it. And then Merc armor. Oh didn't it didn't it say that he would get we would get some Merc armor if we completed this mission? Is it this mission? When we got a mid shop back? I'm sure it said we'd get some Merc armor off him. Maybe Welcome to talk back to, to Cassidy's Fine Clothiers. What can I do for you? Hardly a crossword between us. <laughs> she says nothing but rolls her eyes behind him. Can you tell They've me about your shop? Clothes and adornments for the hundred families for thirty years. Most of them won't buy from anybody else. Well, hate to tell you, but most of them are dead. Of course, we sell to regular folks too. Plenty of less expensive items in stock. Repurposed or restored garments, mostly. Thanks again for your help, old chums. Welcome to the shop, friends. Are you not going to give me anything? Okay, let's get out of here. Let's go see the sheriff. Oh, what's happening here? Yeehaw! Give me a help by Dorsey Thugs! Mickey? Family's taken hostage! Oh, so. Do you ever worry about getting hits to a glory? Hell yeah! I've always got a small for the marshals and never piss them off. I think we should pull some marshals from Broadmoor, put them here in downtown. If an enemy gets all the way to Broadmoor... I like your style, Rangers. I like your style. Thanks for a favor, and you came through for me. No more Dorseys in my city, and everybody can walk out their doors again without getting shot. Well, unless we're about... Some of my marshals weren't too sure about you, but I see now that they were dead wrong. Old oh, Saul yeah. Merc Armor. Best. It was this mission that we were going to get stuff for. So we got Merc Armor and Merc Helmet. Is it? And Merc Leggings. Sweet! Well, we're all on the same side, right? Damn right. It's in all our interests to keep this city safe. Hmm. Now, before I forget... Let me introduce you to Hope Emerson. She heard all about you coming to town, and she wants to join up. Ain't that right, Hope? Pleasure's mine, Rangers. Ran the lockup in a little town called Amity on Colorado's eastern border. Figured I could do the same thing for you at your HQ. Assuming you'll be arresting people now and then? Yes, ma'am. Amity got flattened by the scar collectors a while back, so Hope came west. Been trying to get her to join the marshals ever since. But she keeps turning me down flat. We uh, have some differences when it comes to crime and punishment. But that aside, she's smart, honorable, and she'd be an asset to your organization. So what are the differences? The fact that she's smart and honorable. You guys ain't. Burn! <laughs> Thanks for the referral. And we do need someone for that position. Welcome aboard, Hope. We'll decide for ourselves, Hope. Catch up with you in a minute. Then I will take her. I'll head over to Ranger headquarters in a bit and start fixing up your brig. Cool. I can't think of a better way to serve than to ensure that our justice is fair, even to those who transgressed against it. Yes, ma'am. So, back to business. Did you find out how the Dorseys got into town? Yes. Apparently, they had help from Faran Brigo's gang. Isaac Reed confessed that he helped them. Yeah, yeah. Isaac, it was Isaac Reed. Well, since you already dealt with Isaac, let's concentrate on Brago. 
I'll never understand why the Patriarch let that rat set up shop here. Been nothing but trouble, so him making a deal with the Dorseys doesn't surprise me in the least. In fact, I had a hunch he might be involved, so I sent my best man over to his nightclub, the Little Vegas, to search for a connection. Haven't heard back from him, though, and I'm a little worried. Say, what if I asked you rangers to go to Little Vegas and check up on him? And if you happen to find proof that Brigo helped the Dorseys while you're there, well, feel free to cuff the bastard and haul him in. Um, do we want to do that now? Do we have to do that now if we say, yeah, I don't know. Um, should we just do it? We're on it, yeah. Take down Brago for me, and I'll make sure your HQ gets the best equipped armory this side of the Rockies. Guns, ammo, armor, the whole shebang. Okay, that sounds like a deal. I sent to the Little Vegas is named Delgado. Family man and the best inspector I've got. Keep him safe and I'll owe you another favor. Always a pleasure, Rangers. Always a pleasure, yeah. Anyone leveled up? Oh yeah, we've got a couple of, a couple of people leveled up. Okay. Marshal Kwan. Marshal Kwan. What are his skills? Automatic weapons. Kick ass. And sneaky shit. Okay. Do we need to bring anything else into that? Do we want to spend one on Animal Whisperer? Or do we just make him crack shot? That's allows you to tame friendly animals to follow you and temporarily tame hostile animals in combat. But that's only level 3 and above. Hmm. She's got barter. Timion's got too many at the minute, hasn't he? Tell you what I'm gonna do. Yeah, I'll spend one on Animal Whisperer for Quan. And I'll put another one in um Sneaky shit or kiss ass. We're already level three on that. I think we'll go sneaky shit. And we need to remember to keep him at the front because he's got sneaky shit, so he's got higher perception. Firm. Um, doo -doo -doo. So, coordination's going to be a good one because we get more action points. Better penetration, though. Hit chance and perception again. Um. I think we'll give him. Let's give it get his hit chance up. Yeah. Oh, didn't want to leave that. Okay. So Lucia, I think she's going to be with us for a while now. So let's have a look what she can do. So she's got survival, barter. Let's have another one in buyer. And then weapon modding. Yeah. Yeah. Strength coordination look. She's pretty low on charisma. Not too fussed about. She's pretty low on strength. Let's give her two strength. Yeah, so then she can wear some of the armors that we're getting. To be yearn, my man. 
I just like having him as a lucky. He's a lucky little tank. <laughs> um, these are probably a bit too spread out now. Hit chance. That just does hit chance. Sneaky shit. First aid, barter, kiss ass, lock picking. Give him the one in small arms. Make sure you can hit people with that shotgun. And we'll leave a skill point in there. Um, Lance, get another one in explosives and get another one in automatic weapons. Oh, he's got a perk too. Okay. Hmm. Getting plus two armor, plus 35. Health, oh, another quick slot. Duck and cover. Fire resistance, explosive resistance, leadership. It gives you an ability. Rally. Provide a plus two action point bonus to allies in the radius around you. Cool. Uh, I think we'll go with that. That could be quite handy. I like the idea of him being mainly our leader as well. Just focused on leadership and um, shooting people in the head. Uh, the, the action points. Let's make him a bit stronger. Hmm. No, let's level him up on charisma. Give that leadership range a bit bigger. Yeah, okay, happy with that. We could actually do with healing up. Um so a full house, we're still doing that. We've got a brig. Med med bay doctor. People keep mentioning that doctor at the caravan. Secondary mission, right? So, assume there's no rush to do that. So, how do we get to the. How do we get to this caravan? Let's see where this leads. Are you sure you want to travel to the machine shop? Um, yes. Okay, that was either a long gap of me not saying anything over a boring loading screen or I managed to cut out the loading screen, so big hype if I did. Alright, this kind of looks like it's set up for battle. Machine shop thug, shop foreman. Don't know whether these are just going to start combat with me or not. This could have been a mistake. Let's, have, let's make sure everyone's armoured up, first of all, because we've got some new armour in me. Armour plus one, requires five strength for that. In them helmet Tyrion leave you to last because you're already pretty tanky you have armor 2 armor 4 ice you have them one gives three gives four. You take that corn. 
That suit you. Combat speed minus six. Maybe give them to Ice because she doesn't really move too much. Yeah, that should do. And then we'll see whether these guys are friendly or not. Fuck off, we're busy. I don't really want to mess around with that uh, turret. Machine shop thug, turret, machine shop thug. What did I stutter? I said, fuck off. And you fuck off. Disable failure mechanic. Oh, we haven't got anyone with mechanic. Hey, I'm working here. Hmm, maybe we should just leave this for now. Hmm. Let's see if we can just take this stuff. Hey! Hands off, asshole! Shit. Alright, screw it. I think we'll leave this one for now. Those guys might come in handy later on. I don't know whether we're supposed to be friends with them or not. Sands Lux Apartments on the line. And this one might actually be something. Says she's got a tenant who might be making bombs in. Shush, shush, shush. Let me talk to them. You're leaving out important details. Uh. It's the weirdo in apartment three. He's gonna kill us all. There's all kinds of loud banging coming from his room. And he's not alone. He's got friends in there. They're planning something. I know it. Uh, have you tried calling the marshals? Downtown is their territory. Do you think I would have called you if the marshals had listened to me? They say I call too much. Goddamn lazy, good for nothing. Maybe there was nothing going on those other times, but this one's real. I'm sure of it. Come to the Sands Lux Apartments. Ooh, $150. Now, he's liable to blow the whole place sky high. Uh, sorry, November. Over and out. <laughs> Huh? What do you mean by sorry? Right, I think I'm gonna head back now. Head back to the HQ. Okay, Ranger HQ, I'm managing your squad. Now that you've got a full squad, you might want to kick someone out to make room for flesh blood. Let's talk to Sergeant Greatski to manage your squad and recruit new Rangers. Doesn't really want to kick anyone out. We'll have a look at this, and then we'll call it there for this one, this part. Hi, I'm Austin. I'm new. Welcome aboard. Yeah, Where I know you who you are. Oh, around? Yeah, me too. We, we all are here. Guessing it's gonna be tough getting that Valor kid out of Denver in one piece, but it's gotta be done. Tap and Austin. Rangers. Um, permission to speak? I just wanted to say thank you again for saving my life. If you hadn't talked to Judge Watkins, well, I, I wouldn't be here, and and I'm really happy to be here. I guess that's all I wanted to say. Thanks. Oh, and uh, Mom thanks you too. No problem, kid. Uh. You better go scrub some toilets. Glad 
Glad to see you back, Rangers. Cleaned up the worst of the mess in your absence. Now, what can I help you with? Uh, these volunteers you mentioned where you're getting from. We need to manage our active Rangers. Yeah, we need to manage sure our thing. active Let's Rangers. Have a look. So I can take these guys out and then recruit new people. So if I remove Doc Nails, ready, you go like that. Anything else? Is he still kicking about? Yeah, we sure need thing. To... Let's have a look. Add. Oh yeah, okay, so we can just add him back in. So, how many can we make? Okay. Maybe we'll create someone next time. Ready. There you go. Anything else? Nope. I'll be here. Yep, that's it for now. Uh, what we've got to do next? We are our new headquarters will only be useful, so we need to find out where we we still got we've got a brig. Oh, let's go see if she's in the brig. Down here, wasn't it? Down here. I know that's a Club, huh? Hope Emerson. One salute you as you approach and gestures to the prison brig. What do you think? Scrubbed up nice, huh? What can I do for you? How are the prisoners? I wanted to talk about the prisoner you found when you first got here. The one who survived by eating fungus and bugs. I know you decided to keep him locked up. And I'm not saying you were wrong. It's just... Do we know he's broken any laws? And even if he has, it seems he's been imprisoned here for years. Has he not served his time? I know he's a little unsettling to talk to. But is that reason enough to deny him his liberty? Don't worry. I'm not going to let him out without your say-so. Just wanted to say my piece. Hmm. You're right. Release him. Oh yay! Thank, uh, thank you so much, man. I owe you big, uh, real big time. This won't be the last time you hear from me. <laughs> okay, that might have been a bad idea, but I'm sure we'll find out. Anyway, save the game. Save game. That's it. See ya.